This is One Step Forward, our Lenten series on turning away from the seven deadly sins by practicing the seven lively virtues. Today, we're talking about sloth and diligence. Sloth refers to a sort of spiritual laziness or apathy toward the goodness of God. It's the vice of inaction. Instead of happening when you devote yourself to something bad, sloth occurs when you refuse to attend to that which is good. On the other hand, diligence is the virtue of spiritual action and means persisting in what you know to be good even when doing so fails to bring immediate satisfaction. Since it's all about devoting yourself to goodness, diligence is the natural companion of the other virtues. But instead of developing as a result of the other virtues, it precedes them. The other virtues can only flourish if you first develop diligence. To take one step forward in becoming a more diligent person, challenge yourself to pray at least once every hour you're awake, and set an alarm on your phone or watch so you won't forget. You could pray whatever's on your mind, pray in Our Father, or keep a list of prayer intentions to work through as the day passes. Persistent prayer keeps your mind on God and helps you to be continually open to His will in all things. In the midst of this hourly praying, ask God to help you become less slothful and more diligent, and consider asking for intercessory prayer from someone like St. Thomas Aquinas. His family was so unhappy with his decision to join the Dominicans that they kept him prisoner in a family estate for nearly a year. In the end, his diligence and faith overcame their determination to keep him away from the religious life. St. Thomas became a friar, a priest, and one of the church's most significant theologians and philosophers. Be patient yet persistent about breaking free from this vice, and may God bless you and strengthen you on the road to greater virtue.